There are such sentences in ancient Chinese poetry. Spring's colors fill the garden, but cannot all be contained, for one spray of red apricot blossom peeps out from the wall. Such wonderful reverie is same as climbing over the wall of China's internet. Google, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and other banned foreign websites always evoke some numerous reveries in China. Let me out. Why stop us? The world is so big, I want to explore. The unreachable always unsettles you. What is this wall anyway? GFW, or the Great Firewall, has been used to monitor and filter the internet by the Chinese government since 1998. This wall is at the interface between the domestic network and the foreign network, which is built up of software and hardware such as computer and network equipment. It relies on key technologies such as IP blocking at national entry gateways, keyword filtering blocking at backbone routers, and domain name hijacking to maintain the internet clean. They work together to block undesirable information on the internet and provide the foundation for network security. The purpose of the wall is not to keep us from going out, but to detect suspected ill information and to keep them out. They may include information about pornography, gambling, illicit drugs, cults, illegal politics, violence and bloodshed, etc. The wall blocks these by URL and IP address. But to be fair, for some technical and other reasons, the good guys and bad guys can be caught together in this defense process, occasionally causing us some inconvenience. As for the network security, firewalls are dedicated to preventing damage from hacker attacks, guaranteeing the orderly and smooth flow of basic internet communications, and giving security to our citizens' personal information, national information, etc. For example, by responding to DDoS attacks, isolating spam, monitoring internet viruses, and ultimately, large-scale cyber wars and invasions. Like the old saying said, although Jack Ma's success cannot be separated from his own struggle, it is also necessary to consider the course of history, such as the Great Firewall that gave him the opportunity to create the right place at the right time. Why do we say so? The wall has a very important function, to protect domestic industries. Just think about it, if you open the wall too early, foreign networks like Facebook and Twitter will swarm in and take over China's huge market. And where will we put Baidu? How about Alibaba, even Yoku, Sina, and Ai Chi Yi? We all know that tariffs on imported cars will help protect the development of the domestic auto industry, and that it can gradually participate in international competition only after it continues to grow bigger and stronger. The independent brand development of internet companies will likewise require a quiet period to develop. When the domestic companies are ready to compete with the world, then open this wall up. As China enters the era of Internet Plus, the internet is closely related to our production and daily life, but because it is virtual, open and cross-regional, it also puts forward higher requirements for the security of network content and information technology. While the country's imports and exports are protected by customs and computers are protected by antivirus software, the internet needs to be protected by the Great Firewall. People often do not feel the importance of lifeguards when swimming, but if such life-saving measures are not set up in advance, it will be too late when a real disaster occurs. It is important to analyze on a case-by-case -case basis, and at certain times, walls are necessary.